Profesa Nyangnyongo ametoa taarifa kwa waandishi wa habari kuhusu mabadiliko yanayotarajiwa katika sekta ya sukari kufuatia amri ya waziri wa kilimo Peter Munya kusitisha uigizaji wa sukari kutoka nje. As the new governor, governor of Kisumu together with my colleagues in the Lake Region Economic Block we initiated a consultation process for all the interested parties in the sugar industry to chart a way forward. This initiative, ladies and gentlemen, finally brought in the Minister of Agriculture and an agreement was finally reached to set up a task force with very clear terms of reference to determine what was needed to be done to reform and revive the sugar industry. The terms of reference also included determining a new policy for the sugar industry as well as regulations that would help implement that policy. His Excellency the President, in his wisdom, has finally formed a task force chaired by the Minister for Agriculture and the Chairman of the Council of Governors with the members representing key stakeholders. One, to come up with a policy to revive the sugar industry, and two, to suggest the regulations that would be used, used to implement that policy. I was privileged to be a member of that task force. After the task force finished its work, His Excellency the President therefore received the report from the Minister for Agriculture, Honorable Munya, and the Chairman of the Council of Governors, His Excellency Oparano, and that task force that was now finally to come out with a way forward did advise the minister to inform His Excellency the President that all of us in that task force had looked at the, task, the policy and recommended far-reaching reforms in the sugar industry. It is the report of this committee launched by the President early this year, whose recommendations now form the policies announced by the President yesterday to finally put our industry on a strong growth path. The chapter of discussions, consultations is now over. And we are now all agreed that what the President has done is exactly what we have labored for so many years to put in place to save the industry. I therefore want to thank the President very much for this step is taken because in this region, Nyanza region and Western region, sugar is the main cash crop that our people depend on. And sugar is the center of the future of agriculture. Now,